This is a video of the simulated version of the Leonardo robot under development in the Robotic Life Group at the MIT Media Lab. We are working towards making Leonardo able to learn within a natural social interaction with a human partner. This demonstration shows how Leo can participate in guided exploration to learn about his environment, a new toy box. His internal motivations drive an exploratory behavior that can also be influenced by interactions with a human partner. Leo has four primitive actions or gestures that he can direct towards objects in the environment. He can make a pressing motion, a lifting motion, and can make a sliding motion to the left and right. Leo does not have any prior knowledge about the toy box. Through a guided exploration, he will learn that making a pressing motion towards the box toggles the lid color between green and not green. When the lid is green, a sliding motion to the right will open it, and the color has to change back to not green before a sliding motion to the left will close it. Throughout the video, Leo has a human partner that is off-camera to his left, and the state of his internal motivational drives is visualized at the bottom right. Initially, the novelty drive is low, causing Leo to explore the various actions he can do in this state. The activity drive rises and falls with each action. The pressing motion causes the box lid to change color. Changes in state cause the novelty drive to rise, and a significant change in novelty causes Leo to create a task representation of the most recent world state change. In this case, Leo creates the task representation that when a closed box is on, it can be pressed to make it off. Once novelty subsides, Leo continues to explore. Throughout the exploration, the human partner can suggest actions for Leo to try. When Leo has completed an action the human suggested, he will look up to give an opportunity for feedback. The human partner can also label a state change, which increases the likelihood that Leo will create a task representation for this change. Leo also acknowledges the human's label with a head nod. In this case, Leo creates a task representation with the label open, that when a closed box is on, it can be made open with the sliding inwards action. Once novelty subsides, Leo continues to explore. Turning the green lid off in the open state is novel enough that a task is created. Leo learns that an open box that's on can be pressed to make it off. Since there's only one feature difference between this task and the first task, Leo makes a generalized version of the task to turn the box off that does not contain open or closed. This is a hierarchical representation such that the more specific versions are, cont are contained as children of the general version. These are not utilized for execution, but could be brought back if the general task representation is deemed unreliable or unsuccessful. A known task is considered relevant when it can be initiated from the current state. When this is the case, Leo would decide to practice a known task if the mastery drive is low. The mastery drive is a reflection of the current confidence level of the task set.
The task to make color off becomes relevant when the color goes on. Leo decides to practice this task and is successful at achieving the goal state. This makes Leo happy and increases the confidence in this task and the actions used to achieve it. In this case, Leo notices that he can initiate a task to make the box closed and then open it again, but is unsuccessful in the first attempt. The open task is still relevant, so Leo tries a second time and succeeds.